guys hope you're all doing well so I am back and refreshed from my cruise vacation and I arrived home in my birth month it is June okay all right uh yes my birthday is this month and so that means I'm gonna be shopping okay um so this will be like the first haul um, that I want to show you guys in this month. I made an order for more Rare Beauty. Uh, that should be coming soon. Really excited about that. But like, yeah, just celebrating my birthday this month. You know how we do. All month. Okay, so I this was unintentional. I went to the Dollar Tree seeing what's new. Um, and Ioni Cosmetics really came through. I found some great gems, some great beauty gems um, this uh, this time around so I'm going to show you everything I picked up from the Dollar Tree uh, we're going to start with the things that aren't Ioni cosmetics because there are there are just a few things and then I'll get into all the new stuff um, that I found so let's do that I found a toner so I found in the Dollar Tree not this past uh, not this past trip to the Dollar Tree but in one of my other trips the Dollar Tree and they've carried this brand other times before. The Yes brand, they've carried the wipes, they've carried the uh, masks and things like that here from time to time. It's not consistent, but from time to time. Um, and I found one. I would have got more than one. I found one. I don't know. I got lucky. This is the Yes to Tomatoes Daily Blemish Toner. I'm working through toners. Right now, my favorite toner is the Thayer's. Um, I'm almost done one of the bottles that I'm working with, and I'm not going to repurchase it until I go through the other toners I picked up from the Dollar Tree, the Bolero one. So, working through toners, but I have this one, Daily Blemish Toner, $1.25. Really excited about it. Um, it, has, it has charcoal in it for blemish-prone skin, which is me. Um, so, yeah, go to your Dollar Tree. Alright, beauty items. We are going to get into some random things really quickly. I got a liquid lipstick from CoverGirl. They had this shade and they had um, a blue shade that I did not pick up. This is the CoverGirl Melting Pout um, Liquid Lipstick in the shade Vinyl Vow. Okay, let's swatch that. Dollar 25 Tree is what y'all call it. It's a beautiful nude. It's giving, um, with vinyl in the name, I'm not sure if this will be matte dry down matte doesn't seem like it will but, um i don't know where i'm gonna put okay i'll put it put that there <laughs> put that there this brand has been in dollar tree for a while this is the essentially ageless line um it's like their i don't know if it's not their house brand but it, they carry all the products for like a full face shade range is abysmal um i picked up the hydrating serum concealer because i wear my concealer pretty bright i picked up medium deep we're gonna swatch these medium deep and light medium this is medium deep let me just show you i kept this one in the packaging because i don't know if the shade range is the shade name is on the packaging doesn't seem like it you get quite a bit you get a full tube um 0 0.5 flip, you get 15 ml, so standard concealer. This is medium deep, you guys. Medium deep concealer. Medium deep. Yeah, not really. Dollar and 25 cents, and I was very curious about it. Um, and then I picked up light medium, which is even lighter, obviously, but. light medium definitely lighter than the medium deep but we got two these serum concealers dollar 25 tree all right i then picked up i found a shadow stick which was really nice i should probably get my wipes ready i found a shadow stick from flower beauty i really like it when so like I love as, as you're gonna see I love the Ioni brand that's like solely in Dollar Tree um, I actually went on the Ioni website to see if they you could ship things but it's solely in Dollar Tree retails in Dollar Tree um, I love those brands that you can like exclusive to Dollar Tree so you know you're gonna find them but I love when you get the gems from like a more expensive brand and you find them in Dollar Tree. Like when I find Milani in there, CoverGirl. I found this Flower Beauty Shadow Stick, only one shade. Um, sorry, okay. Only one shade here. It's a. It's called the um, 
scribble stick for eyes and lips and this is in a nude shade it's called caramel so this is a jumbo shadow stick oh let's see if there's a sharpener on the bottom I feel like by default standard now these size chubby sticks whether it's for eyes or lips should have a sharpener at the bottom and I am correct okay all right all right and this is the shade caramel I looked these up or very close to my skin I looked these up and they were like $15 you can see it there um, so it could be a lip pencil or an eye pencil. Actually, with that shade, I'd probably use it for my lips. That's really nice. So, yeah, I love it when I can catch a hidden gem. Um, this next one came, really, really. I found NYX, and there was a lot there. NYX Loose Pigments. Um, NYX, I don't even think they carry these very much anymore. Let me show you what one looks like. The Ultra Pearl loose pigments let me get in here these came in a two pack I've already opened all of them up because uh, to save time they came in a two pack random two pack configuration so I tried to cover all the shades I wound up getting a couple duplicate shades because some of the same shades were in you know different packages um, but they were two in a pack for $1.25 and I got quite a few colors these are loose pigments I'll open up one just to show you, there's no sift or anything filled up with pigment. All right. And so we have plenty of shades. I'll just show them really quickly. There's nude. Nude and sky pink here. Okay. Quite a few, you guys. Quite a few. I have true purple and walnut here I don't know which packs came in which but I'm just showing them all to you because I had to open them all up uh, we have true pearl it's the pearl shade get my face out of it let's get my <laughs> all right um, we have this beautiful deep shade called black pearl right I have I got a bunch of orange orange and turquoise that's the shade names makes things easy here two in a pack for a dollar and 25 cents and then we have I believe this is penny yes this is penny and then there was a two pack these were two, whoop, two of the same color so I'll give the other one away these are the their bigger pigments so this is what I just showed you and then these are the other NYX pigments and there was only one shade of this and it's pig number 13 this is a bigger container but it wasn't a two pack so we have a bunch of loose shadows from NYX which is exciting exciting now let's get on to ioni cosmetics here let's get into it they have some new lifestyles that i'm going to show you and they have some new cosmetic products so we'll start with the lip products that i picked up first off before i get into the products i took everything out of the packaging but i kept the packaging so i guess this collection this theme is like around the world travel absolutely beautiful so like here's the lip pencil packaging everything it's and it's not the same so this one is um like the Bahamas and the lip plumpers I have here we got pear what we got we got Shanghai they're just the packaging so much artwork on the packaging absolutely beautiful I just I just you know for $1.25 it's like just because you are an inexpensive brand like all of them are different just because you're an inexpensive brand does not mean that you have to skimp on certain things and they went out went all out with this packaging so I saved this so you guys can see and you'll see how pretty the packaging is on the lashes um so let's get into the products the lip the lip products we have these are I got and I got for every item here I got what I saw like I got every shade that I saw um there's some things that I didn't get which was they have new mascaras um, I might go back and try them. I didn't get the mascaras. They have some glitter eyeliners that I did not get. Don't know why. Um, <laughs> but we got these plumping lip gloss. I only saw two shades. Lip plumper gloss. Okay. In this packaging we have a clear. This clear shade is called Glacier. 
and then the pinky shade is called Samba Dance. So we have two plumping glosses. Have not tried these. I haven't tried any of these things yet because I just came back from the store yesterday, day before yesterday. I have like a fruity, like an artificial cherry type of scent. That's the Samba Gloss. I feel like both of them are going to be pretty clear. Um, but we got two plumping glosses. And then I picked up, I just saw two shades of this as well. This is the Shea Butter Lipsticks. I picked up um, the two shades that they had. And one is called China Silk. This is what they look like. Come on, $1.25. Ioni Cosmetics. Come on. Come on. So this is giving more of a tinted balm. Um, there's a, this is a light pinky shade. Okay, it's definitely giving the texture of a balm. It's smooth. It's uh, moist. It's, um, it's, oh my gosh, hydrating. It has a shinier finish. And then this one is Safari Nude. Um, so. Yeah, definitely like tinted balm. This is a little bit deeper. Safari Nude is right there. But they're more of a tinted balm. Um, feel good on my hands so far, but again, I don't know if they have more shades. Um, but that's what I saw there. All right, and then we have some lip liners. Did I get both lip liners? I think I did. Yes, they have lip pencils. Um, sharpenable lip pencils. These are wooden pencils. They're not plastic. So the first one is called uh, Mombasa Spice. Feels good there. Alright. And then the next one is called Napa Wine. And it's definitely a red wine color. Alright. So yeah, these are wooden pencils that need to be sharpened, but they are classic lip liners. Feel good. Feel good. All right, then we have some eyeliners. I only saw two shades. This is the, um, they're just called eyeliner pencils. I have a turquoise shade and a purple shade. The turquoise shade is called Mars Green. Well, wooden pencils as well. That is beautiful. That's a metallic finish on that. Look how bright that is. Gorgeous. And then we have a purple here. Windsor Stone is the name. And all the names are on the packaging, on the product. So those are the two lip liners and these are the two eyeliners. And I saw, hear me out, Chubby Sticks. Um, so these, they're literally called Chubby Sticks. Um, it did not specify, probably should look at the packaging to see if it specified um, what these should be used for. Let's see. See if I can grab, okay, Chubby Stick. It says lip line, oh, it's for your lips. It's for your lips. Lip liner and lipstick in one. Okay, so I thought they were for your eyes. My bad. Lip liner and lipstick in one. That's kind of weird though because there's a, whatever. So, I got four shades. The four shades that they have. Let's go. Bali Gaze. And these are jumbo wooden pencils. Haven't seen those in a long time. That is so nice. Take you back, right? Bali Gaze is a metallic um, bronze. See that? make more sense for your eyes but what do I know um this pinky shade is called Mexico pink oh that's vibrant that's vibrant super vibrant dear lord a red here is called kimono cherry okay I get those two being for your lips. Then they have a, a, a white. It says French white lily. That's why I was like, your lips. What do I know? <laughs> but chubby sticks. All right. Okay. Whatever. We're going to play with them. I need to reorganize. 
Um, I might film it. I need to reorganize um, my eyeliner, cream, liquid, eyeshadow kind of situation um, to get more use out of those. And I think I will film it. Let me know if you want to see it. Um, I haven't done an organization like show you how I organize in my thought process um, because, yeah. I just need to refresh it and to get more use out of what I have over there because they're kind of just hidden away over there. Um, and I don't know why I got on this, but um, yeah, I want to reorganize that. I need, I'm going to try not to buy a lot of things for it. Kind of want to use what I already have minus one thing that I need. I, I really want a different type of organizer. I'm going on a, a tangent right now. Um, but let me know if you want to see that. I have to figure out how I want to reorganize it first. I'm in that process. And once I figure out how I want to reorganize it, figure out what I need, then I can film the process. <laughs> okay. And then finally, you know, we got to talk about lashes. So they have, so Ioni makes bomb lashes and they have their own lash glue. It's okay. I've used it a couple times. A few times that I've bought it for other people, it's like, it's been dried out. Um, so it's like, okay, I use my own lash glue you know, other brands, but they have released some new different types of lash glue. They have a liquid lash glue that's black. I didn't get that. I don't, um, I didn't get that in the tube, but they have this, um, you're not going anywhere lash glue. It's a new, uh, packaging, 100% vegan, fast drying, gentle, late tech, three long lasting. So I bought this to check it out because $1.25 lash glue, I will stock up, friend. All right. I saw my YouTube wife, Emily Noel 83, review this lash glue from, from Ioni. I did not get it. I don't even know that it exists. Whatever. I didn't get it before. And she talked about how great it was. This is their, the felt tip pen. The felt tip pen. It's a two-in-one lash glue and eyeliner. And it's in black. I'm not... I don't like black lash glue because if I, I'm messy and I get everywhere, you got black lash glue. I prefer glue that dries clear. But if I'm wearing eyeliner or if I want to use this as eyeliner, um, but apparently it adheres well and she used it and she really liked it. And so I bought two of them because you know if it's really good and we love something, you'll never find it again. Um, and this has a little bit of weight to it, this pen. So I did pick up both two of those. Now let's get into the lashes. Um, these were all the new sets um, with the um, with this new packaging um, and the names. And when I put these in my inventory, looked at in my inventory, the names I was like, okay, well maybe like they're just releasing the same ones that they have in new packaging. Um, no, these are new styles. Um, so the first one I got two pairs of the fluffy full feather style. First off, let's get into this beautiful packaging. Look at that artwork. Look at the artwork on these lashes. Fluffy full feather. And these are the 3D faux mink. I picked up two pairs of those. Two pairs of the XL Wispy Full. These have a beautiful butterfly packaging. Those are the lashes. Two pairs. Um, and we have, I got three pairs of these because these look beautiful. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Fluffy long crisscross. Beautiful. A dollar twenty-five for these lashes. Can we get into it? And then this last set, I would have bought five or six of them if I could find them. I got the last two that I could find. And these are the fluffy fishnet clusters. They look divine. So excited for those. Look at those. A dollar twenty-five. A dollar twenty-five. Like, I'm looking at my lash color. Love lashes. So that, also, we know the Dollar Tree now has the expanded 
kind of like five below. They have things for five dollars, up to five dollars. This basket was three dollars. I think it's a nice size to hold my holes, <laughs> my makeup holes. So I got that basket, but um, yeah, that is the new beauty stuff I picked up from the Dollar Tree. Um, there will be a lot of holes in the month of June. Um, yeah, and probably organizational videos to, you know, spruce up this space, refresh. And I hope you guys are ready to come along for the ride. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns about any of the products mentioned in this video, feel free to leave it down below. Love you all and talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.